behind closed doors or out in public for others to see. The just, the forced, fighting the battles they couldn't win, they did not deserve to be hurt, let alone die out of the hands of hungry men. The men that hunger not for food, but for flesh, for power, for pleasure, Empty-hearted with sadistic intentions, willing to torture for satisfactions, scarring the lives of innocent women who are only working to provide the living of their families. They are lost souls, longing to find home, to find hope, to find safety, and reclaim the lives they used to call theirs. Even now, potentially, victims of rape will be locked up next to the murderers and kidnappers. That's, that's where we are not throwing these cases under the bus and deserve them as mute cries for help. They needed to be heard for God's sake. To know we stood by them, to be able to make them realize that someday, just someday, maybe hope exists. I will not carry on with my life with no worries when I know there are women treated as slaves and objects criminalized by the law because of the rapists who can keep their fix inside their pants. I am outraged by the ignorant people treating sex as something cheap. Consent needed to be granted, valued, not forced, nor paid. Let there be justice and not let them split victims behind bars. You hear that, legislators? We will not take any of your shitty written laws. Even my dog knows no means no. For fuck's sake. Did you hear that? The muffled screams coming from the darkest alleys, left with no help. Will we help them this time? Thank you. <laughs> this is based on uh,